pretty impressive, huh? You'll get used to it. Soon you'll look at this place like any other school. Oh, I hope not. Well, maybe not like any other school on Earth. We should probably find our rooms, unless you want to sleep here in the hallway. Who are the witches of Cloud Tower? Magix has three schools. Ours is one. There's the Red Fountain School for Heroics and Bravery. That's where the hero guys go. Finally, there's Cloud Tower School for Witches. Witches? Wow. Yeah, well, it's better to just steer clear of them. Move along now, let's not loiter. Don't you have something to do? Hi there, I'm Celise. Hi Celise, my name is Bloom. Nice to meet you. I think this is your room right here. I guess I should find my room now. Here we are! Wow! Hi there! Hi, my name is Bloom. This is Stella. Bloom, according to the arrangements, we'll be sharing a room together. My name is Flora. Looks like I've got a room to myself. Same one as last year. I wonder who's in the third room? That would be us. I'm Musa. And I'm Tecna. Nice to meet you both. I'm Bloom. This is Flora. And Stella. Oh, Miss Griselda made sure everyone knew who Stella was. It seems there was an incident in one of the labs last year. It's still out of order. Griselda always blows things out of proportion. Well, as long as you warn us before you blow anything up. <laughs> Especially the dorm room. I think I'm going to have a look around the school. See you all later. I really should get to my room. I haven't even met my roommates yet. Um, hi, my name is Bloom. Is something wrong? Hi Bloom, I'm Sarisa. Someone has played a practical joke on me. They put a spell on my locker. I'll bet it was Amaro. Maybe I can help. some fairy stars. Professor Whiskers might be interested in them. He's in the library. Thanks again. Welcome to the Althea Library, young lady. I am Professor Whiskers. Hello, Professor. My name's Bloom. Ah, uh, Bloom. You're our new student from Earth. It has been quite a long time since we've seen a fairy from Earth here at Althea. In fact, I didn't think there were any fairies left on Earth. You've heard of Earth? Oh yes, we even have some artwork from Earth here. Use the projector at the back of the library if you would like to look at them. It is powered by fairy stars, so you will need to find some. Thank you, Professor. I'll do that. Here's a little something for you as incentive to come back. You might want to return to your room. I think your friends may have some interesting news for you. Thanks, Professor. I'll be sure to keep my eyes open. Oh! 
room! Did you hear? The specialists are coming! The specialists? Yes, the boys from the Red Fountain Academy! The school's holding a ball and they invited the boys from Red Fountain and we're all going. Sounds interesting, doesn't it? It would be a great opportunity to observe courting behavior in... I can't wait! I've got the perfect outfit! Oh, but I've got nothing to wear to a ball. I've got an idea. You should speak with Luma. She's taken a lot of fashion design classes. I think I saw her heading towards your room on the first floor. Maybe she can help. That's a good idea! She really knows fashion, almost as much as I do. It. What are you talking about? I've designed a new line of outfits that you would be perfect for. Only, they're unfinished. That's a shame. I really needed something for the ball. Well, I've got a great gown that's nearly done. If only I could find my scissors, I'm sure I could finish it for you in time for the ball. I'll help. Where have you been today? Hmm. I helped decorate the ballroom for the dance did some research on retro headdresses from the pre-Rhodian cargo cults of Farana, and measured Professor Whiskey's for a new hat. I'll trace your steps. I'm sure I'll find your scissors. It's Red Fountain School. My father teaches there. He can't believe his little Pia is at Althea. Well, Pia, my father can't believe I'm here either. student from Earth, aren't you? What a backwards place that is. more outfits for you if I had a few more things. If you find any interesting items, bring them to me, and I'll give you a new outfit. Thanks, Luma. I'll keep my eyes open. Bye, Bloom. Enjoy the ball.
Oh, hi. I'm Bloom. I'm Brandon. I'm studying at Red Fountain. Well, I'm glad to meet you, Bloom. Really? Uh, yeah. Studying at Red Fountain means I only get to hang out with other specialists. That can get kind of boring. Yeah, I guess talking to different people is good. I spend all my time with the other fairies here at Althea, but I've made some wonderful friends already. So, do you like being here in Magics? Yeah, it's really exciting to be here. Good. And, you know, there's going to be a lot more for you to discover in time. Well, I have to go now, okay? Already? I'm sorry, Brandon, but I hope we'll see each other again soon. Yeah, it was cool meeting you. Wake up, Bloom. We have a class this morning. I was having the best dream. <laughs> was it about a certain blonde-haired boy? Oh, Stella! You shouldn't tease Bloom about Brandon. You're right, Musa. But I would be surprised if she wasn't dreaming about Brandon. She didn't take her eyes off him all night. <laughs> hmm, that's interesting. By that theory, I guess you were dreaming of a certain prince. Techna, you made a joke. What's going on? We have a class in nature magic this morning. Professor Palladium will be taking us to Black Mud Swamp. I can hardly wait. Well, I hope it won't get too messy. We'll meet you in the professor's classroom. Oh, Kiko, the ball was so amazing. I met a great guy. I hope I get to see him again. I could never show my face in public after even talking with a squire, let alone dancing with one. Imagine me, Amaral, with a squire. Ridiculous. <laughs>